26 riders on the grid then. World Super Sport 2011 is ready to kick off. They're holding them a long time. Yeah. The lights are on. Oh, they're off. They go. Good start from Salon. Good start also from Scassa, big man or not, as they go pouring down the Gardner straight now. Marino got a terrible start, Jack. Way down. So flying into the first turn. The first thing is to get everybody safely through, which we do. Good start by Robin Harm, the distinctive pale blue Benjamin Racing Honda. He's always busy. Honda, incidentally, have only lost once since 2003 around this track. But I tell you what, there's a couple of Kawasaki's at the front, and they are ready to lay down the law once again, because in 2007, Fabian Foray yeah. won for Kawasaki. Yep, uh, they can do it round here. Virtually the same team he rode with last year. And look at Sam Lowe's. Yeah. Already we've lost Ivanov. Ivanov has crashed on bike number 60. But Sam Lowe's looks very keen to get to the front. Confidence abounding for the young British champion here. Yep. Lowe's up the inside. But look at this. Chas Davis launches the Yamaha R6. I tell you what, the speed's still intact from 2009, yep, is, yep. James. He got a little bit of help from the slipstream there. He got two bikes to slipstream down yep. the main straight. And now, oh, and look at this, Chas Davies just whoops in a straight line past Brock Parks. And here comes Sam Lowe's on the Park Gar Honda, who's replaced Eugene Laverty and Simon Buckmaster's team. He, too, makes the pass and tries to go for the inside. And he does, as they go through the southern loop, Sam Lowe's from Lincoln is through into the lead in his first World Super Sport. No, sorry, his second World Super Sport race. He wildcarded at Silverstone last year. And look at this, Sam Lowe's. In the lead for Park Gar Honda, his debut race for the machine, debuting a new helmet of rather distinctive colour as well. It's more like a speedway helmet than a road race helmet. Look at these lads swapping positions down the yeah, street, and Sam got swapped by three bikes at once. All because of slipstream. Slipstream, exactly that. When you get three or four bikes in front of you, it makes a real big difference. And, oh. uh, and the, uh, the motorcar.com. Yamaha's, Yamaha's, Kawasaki swapping paint. Now, Sam Lowe's regroups in fourth place. Chas Davis now at the front for the parking goal Yamaha. He won't have a problem with that one, Sam Lowe's, I've got to say. Sam Lowe's coming up the inside, but look at Davies. See Body that around the outside, look at that. <laughs> oh, oh six oh, abreast, dear, boys. Dear. No, it's seven of them, sorry. Oh, There's seven of them together. <laughs> And the battle of the Brits is on for second place. It's uh, Welshman Davies versus Lickerchman. Oh, oh Lowe's decided he's not going to hell get oh. held up this time on the entrance Just of the Southern Loop. So, so quick round that section, is Lowe's. He comes from Tuscany in the centre of Italy. And uh, obviously, with his dad's influence, he was into road racing. He was actually into road racing by 1999 on a Look 125 at the Aprilia. Speed of that Yamaha, of Scassa's. Yeah. And he's just swept in past both of them. Oh, Scassa takes the lead. I've forgotten to count how many leaders we've had in this race, James. I reckon it's five so far. Look at that. Look how tight he can run yep. through the fast stuff, so though. So confident with the front yeah. end as well in the fast uh, corners. Ooh. Well, you can't overtake in the fast stuff, but he almost did. Oh, over Lukey Heights, he nearly, I've never seen anyone get inside someone on Lukey Heights, but he close to did oh, it. He's nearly done. done it now in no, turn 11. Scassa carries the speed through yep. on the wider line. Wow, nerve-tingling stuff then from Sam Lowe's. Sam Lowe's, number 11, 20-year-old. Reigning British Super Sport champion, and I'll tell you proving his pedigree. And that bike is not as quick as the Yamaha. No, Even in the no. slipstream, it can only hold station. Where Scassa went past two riders using the slipstream down the straight. Lowe's is definitely quicker in the fast corners. Look at look that. Look at that. He's just eased him out, giving Take him nowhere to go. He's got that. the inside line. <laughs> It's almost reminiscent, oh. although different colours, it's reminiscent of... Uh, uh, Norrie Harger. Well, Hills, I think Hills helmet design. Graham and... Uh, oh, I'm sorry, you're talking about yeah. the helmet. Yeah, 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 uh, very much Graham Hills Henley Bolting Club design, but in a different colour. Look at this, it's really compressed again, it the is. top five, yeah. knitted together with six laps left. That's 55. Oh, Massimo Rockley. Yep. So that's one of our previous race winners punch, out yeah. of the contest. It's Black a puncher. Yeah. Good Lord, that's a rare thing to see in a racing bike. It is, it is. 
surface here, quite as emphatically flat as that. Watch this. So, 11, watch this. low, Scassa now. Scassa slipstream straight past Laws down the straight. Yeah. Watch this. He's, and he pulls out early. Oh, he scarcely needs any slipstream. The problem with that is, he's going to get him over the line if he's, in, you know, if yes. that's the last lap. Oh, and uh, Marino, I think. No, it's not. It's well, Fabian Foray. It is Foray. Foray's gone. Now, is that anything to do with his hand injury? They were really concerned about the state, particularly of that middle finger, where the tendon that extends the finger back was so shaved and open that they were worried it would snap. I think it's got to be something to do with his uh, condition. I think so. I think it, it might looks be. like it is. A it? distraught Fabian Forrest. He really dominated uh, the whole of qualifying. Oh, it's a flat tyre. Oh, it's a flat tyre. It's another flat. We've got two flat tyres in one race. Two rear flat tyres. That's... That's un un really unusual, it is. And look at that, Davies has been completely drafted by the Kawasaki's and uh, instantly pushed back to fifth place. Well, how's that happened? Slip streaming. Has, he got, has he got a problem? Because he's, he's lost a lot of ground in into a the very short loop. space of time. Yeah, he has, yeah. Yeah, we're talking about tyres, Jack. Yeah, sorry. Another flat, another flat. And For Davies. That is Davies. Oh. I'll, I'll tell you something, that is an issue with the tyres. It's got to be. Oh. That's the third one. I was going to say, two is unusual, three, three. there's definitely a problem. Well. And that's and that th there's oh. got to be a problem with those tyres. Remember, da all Davies was abs was pretty he was pretty much solid on for a Rostam finish. He was, there. yeah, yeah, he was. Possibly, and, possibly and you were the dead right, he lost a lot of time. And that tyre obviously, I mean they've, they've gone fairly quick because that's all happened yeah. in a lap, which to me says it's not air kind of sneaking out, it's not no. a slow puncher that you get sometimes on a dodgy valve that's letting air out gradually. That's something that's gone fairly quick and lost a lot of air in a short space of time. We're approaching the last lap flag, and would you believe that old, wily old rascal Brock Parks is actually through into third place and threatening and the leaders. One lap to go then. Who's it gonna be? Scasser leads it. Number 11, Sam Lowe's, comes out of his slipstream, but can't quite make the speed. Brock Parks has come right up on the back wheel of the two newcomers ahead of him. Anything could happen on this final Absolutely. lap at Phillip Island. Absolutely. And I tell you what, if anybody, from what I saw in British Championship last year, if anybody's prepared to push, I'd love to say he's going to take second place in a rostrum and get his season off to a good start, but I, if I know Sam Laws, he will have a go. Time's running out now for Sam Laws. He needs to be making his move. We know he's quite strong at sort of hay shed here and up into Lukey Heights. We know that. But not sort of scasser. Oh, oh, he's got oh, blown! Look at that. He went through him on the edge of the Lukey put, Heights. And that puts him on wow. the inside. That's good. That puts him on the. He's scasser. Gonna have a look at Oh, the you said that Sam Lowe's was brave I, enough I, to have a bash. He is, and he had to do it in the fast stuff, Jack. He had to do it in the fast stuff. I, I think he knew he wasn't quick enough but in he's, the slow stuff. James, he's looking at him trying to make the time now. And he will do. He's put, he's, what, he knows he's got to he, pull the pin. He could get lad, slipstream. I knew he'd have a go. I knew he. But look, Scasser's close. And so to his part. There's got to be some weaving. There's got to be. And what's he going to do? What's, what's Sam Lowe's going to do? Because has he got the flat out speed? They're going no, for the line. Here comes Scasser. Oh. And Parks. And Scasser's done it. Scasser's done it. I tell you what, that's cruel for Sam Lowe's. <laughs> cruel. <laughs> Lucas Scasser won it by 0 0.009 of a second from Simon Bookmaster's Parkelgar Honda with. And it's Brock Parks who nicked second. Yeah, Parks it, got it, second it, place. Sam Lowe's got third. Well, he gets a third, and that—that that, I tell you something—that's cruel. He needed. He's, he's three or four off. Oh, and here's Florian Marino just getting the best of Vito Iannuzzo and Alexander Lunders. They plummet across the line, and that was a battle for seventh place in the end. James Ellison benefiting from that rash of punctures, finished six behind Robin Harms, and oh well. I've got to say, what a great football, what a great race and what a great finish. Absolutely fantastic race, but that is a win for Sam Laws, if you ask me. He need, <laughs> honestly, he, need, he needs a yeah. four or five brake horsepower there, which isn't a lot when you're talking about 140, 145 horsepower. I'll tell you what, horsepower. though, he'll still be grinning. It and will, I, no, and it he, will. And that, that will, move of Lucky, Lucky Heights, but the, don't take it away from Scassa. I mean, what, he, no, of course you, you can. know, first, that, first, first Lawson, race out in yes. Supersport. That's good, but Sam Lowe's rode better than Lucas Casser, in my opinion. <laughs> I'm not partisan yeah. in any okay. way. <laughs> and you know, uh, Scasser, incidentally, he's never raced super sport before, you know. He's always no. been on the big bikes. No, he's a good rider. Yeah. I'm, not, I'm not taking anything away from him, but 
you know, it's so cool as a rider to put all the work in. You're yeah. on a slower bike, you, you, you make a plan, it comes off perfectly, you do everything right, and you get zapped between the last corner and the line. For, you know, that's... I think you get the impression the crowd have enjoyed that.